Art is in the eye of the beholder, and some artwork planned for Tigard's Main Street redevelopment project raised a few eyebrows at last week's city council session. Yeah, because of that, the original concept for the sculptures is now under revision. Tim Becker shows you what they are tiptoeing around in Tigard. The sculptures will go in a couple of different places. One of them will be right here at the South Gateway to Main Street in Tigard, the other one on the North Gateway. Now, the original concept for the artwork. Filbert, surrounded by blooms, is the result of what the artist calls a community visioning session. He was inspired by this phase in the, uh, okay. where it's sort of in between a blossom and a nut. Downtown redevelopment manager Sean Farelli shared the visual proposal with us. Together with some stonework, welcome to downtown Tiger. Two Filberts sculpted from metal about 14 feet tall. The one comment we got from our citizen uh, committee, committees that have mm -hmm. strongly endorsed this is that maybe they should be bigger. Last week, though, a city councilman wondered how the scene might play out, quote, with two nuts sitting at the end of Main Street, unquote. There was this one concern stated, and, you know, mm -hmm. I think we are. We're going to take all the comments that we heard and we're going to refine the concept. So Ferrelli says the city is working now with artist Brian Borello to make a few tweaks, hopefully keep wandering minds in line. We're still taking a look at the number and the scale and the color. I think we'll probably end up on a number other than two. Chances are you've seen Borello's work like this around Portland. He's out of town, but promised me today, Tigard's first large-scale public arts project will be magnificent. We don't want to have any, uh, you know, become the butt of jokes, even if it's by, you know, junior high school kids. In Tigard, Tim Becker, Coin 6 News. And, you know, the history of that is that was an area years ago covered by Filbert Orchards. We're always investigating, so we'll stay on top of this story. I'll let you know how the nut story turns out.